surprised how many of you guys wanted to see this video. I always put polls on YouTube or on Instagram and ask you what videos do you want to see first. So many of you wanted to see Dollar Tree, so here it is today. If you saw my haul, I couldn't find absolutely every product for a full face, but 90 to 95% of this video is. So the only thing I didn't have was a primer, which I used the e.l.f. putty primer. There was no foundation or BB cream that I found, so I'm going to be using this one from L'Oreal, the Infallible Pro Matte, and... My brows are already done, and also a highlighter. Jump right into the video, and if you're new, welcome. My name is Jen, and please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. I'm gonna go apply the foundation, and we'll get started. Oh my god, I totally forgot that we have this um, Conceal Correct from LA Colors. It's purple. And I don't even know how you use this. I think it was before the foundation, but I'm gonna put it here and see what happens. I have the LA Colors Press Powder in the color Nude here. Just using this Real Techniques brush. Powder. Oh my God, this brush is so soft. From bronzer, we have this Beauty Benefits Hollywood Bronzer. I remember from the haul, because I did the haul like a month ago. I don't remember if it was too dark. Let's go light. Well, I mean, hey, that has a lot of pigment. And this is a wet and wild brush. Definitely, if you're really light, go light-handed, because look at that. The nose of it. I know this is a huge brush for the nose, but that's okay. This is the LA Colors Peach Rose Blush. It does have some like glitter, so I don't die for glitter in my blush. Well, let's see how this looks. It's not like super pigmented, right? You know what? This is actually pretty. Not my fave. I don't die for it because like I said, this has glitter. A nice color. Next thing we're going to do is our eyes, and for the eyes, we have this LA Colors eyeshadow. The palette is called Glamorous. Lots of purples, love that. I don't know what I'm gonna create, but I'm gonna fast forward to this part. Like I said in the swatches, the, there is barely any um, pigment. You could barely see the colors, my opinion. You see for yourself. And now we're gonna do eyeliner. For eyeliner, I'm gonna be using this, which is the LA Colors Liquid Eyeliner. To try to do it on camera, but I already suck at eyeliner. I can't imagine trying to do it on camera. obsessed with this liquid eyeliner if you love liquid eyeliners you love like a brush instead of like the felt tip is it you need this in your life this is wow love it if there's anything i recommend out of here that is a must is this eyeliner. We also have this LA Colors eyeliner slash brow pencil. So I'm gonna use that to line my waterline. Definitely had to work at it. It's not like you glide it on and boom, you're gonna have color there. No, you really gotta work at it. For mascara, I have two. And that is because I've done two Dollar Tree makeup hauls. I mean, what can we do? You know what? Let's try both. Let's try both. One and one. So we can see how it looks. And definitely, I have to curl my lashes. Alright, for that one, I'm going to use the LA Colors Bold Lash Mascara. I love the packaging. Too adorable. There's nothing in here. 
I'll also put in my bottom lashes, which is probably a disaster. Give me some length. So for this eye, I'm gonna use the Colormates Curved Cara. Ooh, look at that. Super curved. Definitely easier to get your bottom lashes if you would want to do the bottom lashes with the same mascara. I'm gonna put a bit on my lips, but before that, I'm gonna highlight because I have no highlighter from Dollar Tree. So this is another affordable one. And this is one from ColourPop, which is very affordable too. And this is in the color Lunch Money. I did a review comparing um, Lunch Money and Flexitarian. If you're interested, it's on my channel. I'm going to do the lips. And this is by Color Mates. And it's a long-lasting formula. Color Coral Splash. So we're going to apply this. Remember, if you want to see any of the swatches of all of it, uh, watch the haul. Not hating it not something that I would use every day but I love the color oh pretty I'm gonna try to fix this here because this eyeliner it's not looking the best under but oh, final thoughts on the products what I think you should get and what you should not get what I think was worth it I mean they're just a dollar or so but this I would definitely pass I'm sorry the mascara I had to pick one Maybe I would pick this one, the LA Colors one, the bow lashes. Um, this, I mean, look at it. I really like it. I think it's really pretty. And if you want to make it matte, just put some powder like on top with like a tissue and then put powder on top the t of the tissue and it'll be matte for you. But that's, I love this. Wow, I'm pretty impressed. Sorry, I'm pretty impressed. I wouldn't say it's terrible either. That's if you like glitter. But it's a really nice color, nothing too intense. If you like the peachy shade, this color conceal correct thing from LA Colors, I would pass as well. This, oh my god. Like, I said it in my haul, I'll say it again. If I knew this was so amazing, had a brush tip like this. I would have gotten like so many and I have to go back and hopefully they still have this I'm not sure um, if they always like restock on the same or they change it up but hopefully this is like a permanent thing in Dollar Tree love this so much it's a win the bronzer not bad not my favorite thing but it's pigmented you could actually see it on the skin it didn't like blend out super easy but I can't say it was patchy either and the shade is not bad so again this is the Beauty Benefits Hollywood bronzer the eyeliner I would say it's a pass too I really had to work at it and it was hurting because it was going like inside of my eye it's just like not pigmented like if you like a really really light eyeshadow there was two colors of this palette one was more of a neutral kind of tone palette this is this is the one that had the purple so I picked this one but this is the look. Not bad. I think the eyeliner just completed everything. Guys, tried these products. Did it work for you? Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. Click the little notification bell. That way you will be the first to get notified every time I post a new video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.